Hey y'all, thanks for tuning back in to Nizzy's Playhouse. Hey, it's your girl Nizzy and I'm back again with another synthetic wig review for y'all. Mm-hmm. So if you haven't done so already, hit that like button, give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel right there. And while you're down there, make sure y'all hit that notification bell so that you can be notified whenever it is that your girl posts. So I know like my last videos, I was feeling pretty ill and under the weather, but I am back. I'm back and I'm in action and like back like I never left. So let's get into this wig review, you guys. So this wig was provided to me by samsbeauty.com so yeah definitely check them out you guys know i rocks with the sam's beauty so let's talk about this unit that i have on y'all my face says it all so <laughs> this is sensationals curl body 22 inch wig um so yeah so it says it's a vixen Swiss lace wig or whatever. So this one is kind of an older model and I can definitely see why because the Sensational wigs nowadays like oops, sorry the Sensational wigs nowadays are so much better So basically this wig is a lace front wig So you do have the lace from ear to ear and then you have a four-way parting space So the wig comes with little four little in four section and it's sectioned off when you get it so you're able to you know do a all the way back like some two pigtails half up half down or you know I don't know what else you can do four ways four ways it's really endless um, and it has lace in the back so you're able to pull it up into a ponytail but let me tell y'all the tea I can't get this thing around my big head ass big ass head <laughs> I just really don't feel like doing this much work for this wig. Like, I'm just gonna be honest. Like, especially when it don't fit, girl, bye. Who got time for that? Not me. Every time I look at it more and more, I'm liking it, but it's not serving the purpose that it's supposed to be serving. The curl, like the hair is cute. Don't get me wrong. Like I love the curl pattern and everything like that. And I just knew I was gonna come with y'all, come to y'all with a video showing y'all like how all that how all the different ways to do this wig and since I cannot do that I just decided to just do a middle part y'all and like I mean it turned out cute because actually this is like low-key like a 13 by 7 since it goes all the way back you're able to part it all the way back and it doesn't you know I did have to kind of like rough up the back so that you can't see the part all the way back but like if you want like an affordable 13 by seven, this is definitely an alternative dupe for, you know, that whole little new trend or whatever that's going on. So yeah, um, the part is also kind of like pre-plugged. All I did was pull out a few hairs in the front to open the part up and then I put my little powder in and, and um, also apply some heat. Um, I, I will say that you do have to apply heat because the way that they have the parts, like the parts be like this. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Like you have to like flatten it down with some heat. I don't think I would recommend this wig to anyone. Um, it's real cute if you want to do a middle part. It's real cute if you like it like this, then get it. But if you are thinking that you about to be doing all types of styles with versatility with this one, nah. It's a no for me, especially for my big head ass, so yeah. Let me know what you guys think about this unit. Let me know if you guys have this unit or if you're gonna try this unit. And as always, thanks for watching.